Days after Kerala government splashed crores to host the Kerala event, the state plans to conduct Navakerala Sadas in full grandeur despite facing a severe financial crisis. Earlier, there were many allegations regarding the amount spent by government in connection with Kerala events. The Navakerala Sadas is also stalking a controversy. The Registrar of Cooperatives directing the cooperative organizations to find money for the Navakerala Sadas had led to a big controversy. In yet another instance of extravagant spending, the government has approved over Rs 1 crore for a specially designed bus for official government use. The fund was sanctioned by Finance Department despite severe restrictions placed by the Treasury. KSRTC MD Biju Prabhagar requested Rs 1 crore 5 lakh 20 thousand from the Finance Department on behalf of K Swift on September 22nd. After carefully reviewing the request, the department decided to allocate the funds. Starting from November 18, Chief Minister Penarai Vijayan and other cabinet ministers will utilize the vehicle to participate in events associated with the government's statewide outreach initiative. According to the latest reports, the bus has been entrusted to KSRTZ and will have 25 seats. The 25-seater bus of Mercedes-Benz company has been granted and equipped with onboard restroom and washroom facilities for the CM and 21 ministers. The special bus for the chief minister and other ministers to travel during Navakerala Sadas was brought to the Kannur police ground last night. It is indicated that it will be taken to Manjeshwar on November 18th. Earlier, it was decided to take the bus to Tirvanandapuram. KSRTC officials have been instructed to keep all the information in this regard confidential. However, Transport Minister Anthony Raju has come forward saying that all allowing buses is not a luxury. He stated that the bus will be used for future tourism purposes. The move is aimed at preventing the requirement of additional pilot vehicles and security personnel for each minister during the event. He added that the news that the bus is being modified is baseless and travelling in that bus is to avoid traffic jams. There will be 75 vehicles including 21 ministers and their escort. The minister responded that this bus can avoid congestion. Travelling by bus is economical. He said the bus can be used as part of budget tourism. He explained that the construction of the bus is not a secret centre. The Navakerala Sadas is from November 18 to December 24. Meanwhile, leader of opposition VD Sadishan accused the government of splurging public money for the statewide travel of the CM and ministers. Former leader for opposition Ramesh Chanitala in a statement said that only a dictator like Pinarai Vijayan could conduct such an extravagant travel when the state is going through a difficult phase.